So that's my great and immense pleasure, I would even say, uh, to welcome you here at La Cité des Sciences uh, for this uh, EuroHPC Summit Week uh, 2022. Um, so we've been working uh, very hard with the organization and program committee uh, of, the, of the conference to prepare a, a program uh, that is covering the very diverse elements of our ecosystem and of the HPC in Europe. And we have decided to structure the program through thematic days. So today, uh, as you probably understand and know, uh, is the uh, Euro HPC uh, and Ecosystem Day, uh, and I'll cover that a bit, uh, a bit later. Um, tomorrow, we're going to have the Science Day uh, with uh, keynotes on um, the, the climate change, uh, on uh, quantum computing, and on uh, data-driven uh, uh, computing. Um, we'll also have tomorrow uh, uh, poster lightning talks, so this is a new feature of the, of, the, of the event, you, you have the poster in the, in, the, in the foyer where we take the coffees, but we also have given the chance this time to the poster presenter to give a very short introduction on their, on their work, so uh, I expect this to be very interactive and interesting. Uh, of course, uh, uh, tomorrow we're going to also have the conference dinner, and uh, with the coffee breaks also, this is the perfect chance for all of us to at last, I would like to say, uh, connect, discuss, exchange, uh, collaborate, uh, make new uh, plans uh, for the future. I think this is, was uh, uh, daily needed, and I'm so, so glad to actually uh, be able to do that uh, this week. On Thursday, uh, this is the industry, uh, the industry day. Uh, in the morning, uh, we'll have a keynote on quantum computing. Uh, also uh, a keynote of the winner of the uh, Praise Adal of Laser Award of this year. And uh, then we will also award uh, 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 awards to the Summer of HPC uh, students of this year. And finally, we'll have a panel on emerging and uh, uh, applications model and, uh, and implementations. Um, so the, the week uh, is structured with uh, plenary uh, talks in the, in, the morning, in the morning, and these talks are actually uh, live broadcasted, so this is also my chance to say hello to everyone connected uh, remotely. Uh, uh, and so uh, this is really this kind of new way of living uh, experience of events uh, um, in person, but also uh, hybrid remotely as well. Uh, during the afternoon, we'll have parallel tracks uh, that follow a number of uh, uh, also uh, uh, themed tracks. Uh, we have a very diverse, of course, uh, set of uh, 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 sessions, but uh, uh, there is a, a, a logic behind the, the different, uh, the different uh, topics. Uh, Data-driven computing, quantum computing is uh, uh, also a topic uh, that is seen through the, 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 the afternoon uh, sessions. Uh, of course, we'll have updates of uh, where the joint undertaking is, plans for uh, the, the coming uh, uh, years of operations of the joint undertaking. And I would kind of say last but not least in my talk, uh, we'll have a bunch of, a, a large set of presentations from scientists, researchers, industry users having uh, benefited from uh, supercomputing, artificial intelligence uh, in doing their research or developing their projects and, and products. So that's a good chance also to get inspired on what to do with our uh, infrastructure tools and, and methods uh, to, uh, to really benefit uh, society in the end. Uh, I forgot, climate change is also an important topic that will be a, a, a threat over, over the discussions. Uh, also, how we answer our social challenges like uh, COVID-19 and some kind of lessons learned on these, uh, on these uh, uh, type of uh, urgent uh, uh, measures.
Okay, uh, today. Uh, today we start uh, the, the, the week with uh, uh, keynotes on um, the, uh, the uh, I would say, the ecosystem and the situation of uh, the joint undertaking. Um, and of course, uh, I'd like to start with uh, thanking our local host, uh, Jensi, and the Ministry of uh, Education, Science, and Research and Innovation, who made this uh, event possible actually uh, this year in, in Paris. So uh, already thank you to your, for your support and for your collaboration. So um, um, I'll be convening that session, but after, uh, after that session, I invite you to, to attend um, the next session that will start with presentation on the peer review process. So for all of uh, you that would uh, like to get access to the infrastructure or for all of you, you who would be interested in how this process are, are run for the benefit of, of everyone, I really strongly encourage you to, to attend the session. And that very well connects to the user forum session. That is the, uh, the, the, the user forum is uh, gathering it's a uh, it's stakeholder and discussing topics that are relevant uh, in, the, in the framework of using uh, the supercomputers uh, in, on the practical side of things. Um, so this afternoon, uh, more precisely, we're going to have um, uh, the, so as I said already, EuroHPC undertaking uh, new missions for 2022-2027. We're going to also have the a workshop on the European HPC ecosystem, um, uh, a parallel session uh, organized by the uh, Center of Excellence, um, another session on international uh, collaboration, and finally a session on the European uh, CHIP Act. So as Marilyn said, pick your, your session and be there on time just to make sure that you have seats uh, if you are really lo looking forward to hear what is being said during these, uh, these sessions. And with this, uh, I'm done with my introduction. Uh, I'd like to thank you all for being here.